Heat is a resource that is seldom used in a lot of systems. Typically, this heat is a byproduct of the system and is just wasted into the ambient. However, using a thermoelectric generator, we can convert some of this heat into usable electric power. By applying a heat source on one side of the thermoelectric generator and cooling on the other, we can produce a gradient over the thermoelectric generator, which is then producing electric current from the given gradient. Depending on the amount of the thermal difference across the thermoelectric generator, we can produce different amounts of power. For example, the thermal difference between a human hand and ambient air is sufficient to generate enough power to drive a wireless sensor node, which can then do a measurement of ambient air, humidity, or other environmental variables, and transfer this information wirelessly to, for example, a mobile phone. Here we have an example of a wireless sensor node connected to a thermoelectric generator and a heatsink. By applying a thermal difference over the thermoelectric generator, we can generate power. And we can demonstrate this by placing our hand on top of the hot side of the thermoelectric generator. And the difference between the hand and the ambient is going to produce enough power for the wireless sensor node to perform a ambient measurement and transmit the data to the mobile phone.